What's up guys, Bodhi Davison back with another video. So today's video we're going to talk about creating a Facebook, like a Facebook business page for your Shopify store or for whatever you want to create it for. So there's many different things you can create a page for and I'm going to show you one of the pages that I created just today. I'm actually filming this video at night, which like you guys would be like, who cares? But usually I film them in the morning. So this video is at night and we're just getting it done when we need to get it done. This is what it's all about. Now, first thing I want to show you here is this is screenshots from a, this guy was 17 years old and he inboxed me on Instagram, on my Instagram, that entrepreneur lifestyle. And he said, hey, I create mot motivational posts marketing posts or any style of posts for others and I was wondering if you're interested in having some made for yourself and then I said and you charge for it I assume yes they're 50 cents each I can make you three free of charge as a trial run and I said good hustle and best of luck with it but I'm not interested sorry and he said no problem have a good day now I posted this in the Facebook group and then I was like hang on I should be encouraging this guy so I've actually went back uh, how do I go what was the next one yeah, I actually went back and I said, hey man, I don't need your post, but just because I appreciate the hustle, I will buy one. Do you accept PayPal? And at this point, he hasn't replied yet, but he's probably from America and you guys are asleep at this hour. But um, yeah, like I, I'm going to support this kid because it's cool. It's awesome. Like he's got his own little hustle going on. He's 17 years old and I appreciate the hustle. So I'm going to support him. And he's saying they're 50 cents each. I'm going to pay him way more than that and just make his day. So, um, and I will get him to make the posts, of course, because why not? Like, that's what he says he can do. So he can make me three posts and I'll probably end up paying him like five, ten dollars instead of 50 cents each. So that'll make his day and inspire him to continue being an entrepreneur. And I think it's awesome. So that's that. Just wanted to throw that in there. Uh, what else did I want to look at here? So, if you remember, I said in one of my videos, you guys can't skip through my videos, by the way, because this has been a little bit annoying. I have people message me all the time, which is fine, but they ask me questions that I cover in my videos. If you're skipping through my videos, like you're not watching them day to day, you're going to miss a lot of information. I make sure, and you should know by now if you watch my channel, all my videos are action packed with just like stuff that's going to help you out. Whether it's Shopify, every single video I put out has plenty of tips in it and you got to watch all the way through because I don't just sit here and just chat to myself. I sit here and give you things that you can take action on. So pay attention guys um, because yeah, lots of people ask me the same questions even though I've covered them a hundred times. I had someone inbox me and ask me if I had any Shopify product research videos today. And I want to pull my hair out because I have more than anyone on YouTube, I reckon. I've got like 30 videos now. There is not one way of doing Shopify product research that I haven't covered. I guarantee you that. Go through. I have a playlist of them now. I just chuck them all in the one playlist. Go through there. You, there's like content for days. Like you guys can go nuts with that stuff. So anyway, in one of my videos... I said I was showing you what's a recent trend Bitcoin I'm invested in Bitcoin so I'm heavily interested in it it is trending like crazy um, I showed you on Google Trends how high it is at the moment everyone's talking about Bitcoin my mum asked me about Bitcoin 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 so what did I say as a case study for this um, YouTube channel I'm going to start a Bitcoin Facebook page and just say like just show you guys that you can take advantage of a trend to grow a Facebook page so what did I look up I looked up Bitcoin news in Australia because I'm from Australia for you guys that are new and don't know that but that's probably why you're wondering why my accent sounds so weird but um yeah Bitcoin news Australia so there was Bitcoin Australia and that someone's just made this page and then there's these down here Bitcoin, Bitcoin and crypto Australia but they're not very big. So I was like, righto, I'm going to make one called Bitcoin News Australia. So I made this page today. And what did I do? Found a nice image of Bitcoin that looks cool, that would make people want to click on the page. Like it looks cool. Popping up like that. Um, this cover photo I made on Canva. So all you do here, guys, 
Canva, you can see that I make all my YouTube thumbnails and everything. For those of you that don't know, you can make anything on here. So if you look at, um, <clears throat> and it's free by the way. So if you look at all the different designs, you got YouTube thumbnails that they're in the right size. See the sizing there. Uh, and then you go, like you can go Facebook event cover. So that'll be the right size for your, which page was it? Sorry. For your event cut for your covers. So you can make your cover photos. So I made this cover photo. It took me like, honestly, it took me two minutes. Uh, Bitcoin News Australia and looks, looks pretty good to me. I think it looks fine. So all I did was go, uh, which one was it? Facebook event cover. Just click on that. That'll open it up in a new tab. I just want to make this like some of you guys already know this stuff. I just want to make sure that people that are new to the channel know it as well. Uh, so these ones here with the dollar sign are paid ones. Don't bother with those. Um, they'll give you a lot of free ones as well. Free, free. And like you, then you can customize your own from these free ones. These ones with the dollar signs cost money though. But the free ones you can, um, so that one's free. And you can adjust all sorts of stuff. But you can also just upload stuff. So upload your own pics. Upload stuff and then like this picture that I uploaded. Then I just spread it out so it covered the whole thing. Bam, bam. Do it nice and rough. Uh, it looks blurry because my computer can't keep up when I'm recording like this and going fast. And then what did I do? I just went text. Oh, my computer's really struggling. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. I went text and then add text. And then I wrote whatever it was. Bitcoin News Australia. And you can change the color here, so change it to white, stands out. Uh, actually, I went like that, didn't I? And then you can make it bigger, probably not that big, or it might be right, let's see. Yeah, so something like that, and then I, you can muck around with the color. So you can go to this, and you can choose one of these, that's plain ones, or you can go here, and you can adjust it like that. And then this part here, you can adjust how bright it is as well. So then you just play around with that stuff, guys, and you've got your fonts over here. Um, it's, you know, bold, italic. It's very easy to use. Then when you're done, you just hit download. It'll download it to your computer. As you can see, mine's still sitting here from when I downloaded it earlier. And then you just upload it as your cover photo. So what else do you need to do? Oh, by the way, I haven't even said how I got here. So all you do is go to, if we go to home, to create the page this is what the whole video is about and i almost forgot um so you can go pages there's different ways to get to it but you can go pages and then you can just go over here create page so create page like that and then away you go so depending on what your facebook page you're making is it can be a local business or place and then you can add on in the, all this stuff so this is very important also if you were to get into social media marketing you can create all this stuff for clients and that because people don't know how to do this stuff they'll pay you good money to do this that's why social media marketing sort of blew up this year because all of a sudden everyone realized after ty lopez bring out that um big social media marketing course that anyone can do that you can make money about like doing it because a lot of these stores, like let's say like a mum and, mum and pop store that's like, you know, I'm thinking of Seinfeld for some reason, but like, you know, let's think of someone like a shoe repair company that's been around for 20 years, 30 years, they don't know anything about the internet. You can do all this stuff and get them on the internet because they know, they know enough to know that they're meant to be on there, but they don't know how to do any of it. Like they, don't, they wouldn't have a clue how to run a Facebook ad. If you're a like pro at Facebook ads, or even if you're just an amateur, if you know how to run them though, and read the analytics and all that stuff, then you can do this stuff and they will pay you good money per month, like a monthly retainer. So I can do videos on that. Leave a comment below if you want me to do more social media marketing videos, because I know how to do all this stuff. I've been, I've been uh, building up Facebook pages and helping friends out and helping clients out and stuff for a long time now. Um, so yeah, what would you go? Well, let's let's keep this like Shopify focused. So probably brand or product, I reckon. 
and then what I would do, it says choose a category. If it's your brand or product, I'd probably go website because then you're going to have a link to your website. Um, but you could probably go clothing brand if it's that or whatever. Just have a look through here. But anyway, like website, let's say you go website and then you enter, this is what your page is going to be called. So Bodhi, Bodhi's, uh, what, oh, my caps lock is still on, sorry. Bodhi's the best. And that will be our website. And then you just go get started. That'll bring you to this basic page. Then you'll upload a photo here for your, um, for your profile picture. So make that something catchy looking. Then we've already been over, I've done it back to front, but how to do a cover photo and where you can do that for free. So you can do that on canva.com. Free to use guys. It's one of the, it's something I use all the time. Um, and then I'd start going through and just playing with all this stuff. So the first thing that you probably want to do is go to the about section and then you can play around with this stuff but I would mainly just go to and I'll just show you what I've done here by the way so where it's got website here I've put my coinbase affiliate link so then if if this page gets big right so let's go back and I'll show you what else I'm doing so and I did say this in the video the other day this is exactly what I'm going to do so Bitcoin News Australia people are going to search that or see it pop up in their when they're looking through the search bar because they want to know a bit about Bitcoin news and then there's no Bitcoin news Australia um, page so then they're probably going to click on mine and it's going to help this grow so there's my insights on that one so then let's say that they see the page well you want to have stuff on here so what have I done coin telegraph which I was telling you guys about really really good cryptocurrency news uh, website I've just been sharing their posts so I'll just share their posts and then you've got free content on your page. So the next thing you could do instead of sharing their posts is like go to the actual website and just share the link to their website. And you've got free cryptocurrency news and Bitcoin news on your uh, Bitcoin News Australia page now. So people are going to see this page and they're going to be like, oh, I'm going to like that because it's got content on it. And then you just slowly build it up. So what are your other options? Your other options are, you can, let's, let's not worry about this being Bitcoin. Let's pretend it's your Shopify brand, your Shopify store's brand name. So Bodie's fishing rods or Bodie's outdoor gear. Let's say that that's your Shopify store. That's what this is called instead of Bitcoin News Australia. So Bodie's outdoor gear. What's the point in having one of these pages? Well, when you start running Facebook ads, you can um, then you have a page to select to like run the ads from so if you run Facebook ads from there's no point doing it from your personal account when it's for your branded Shopify gear and then also that link <clears throat> down here so the website link that could be a link straight to your Shopify store so it's easy for people to click on you could have your email in here as well so people can contact you with questions and stuff always be really polite to your customers. Um, you could have your email in here as well. You can, you can edit what the button does. So you could have your email, uh, in there, uh, in this about section, write a bit about your company. I just actually, um, like pretty much copy what was written on coin telegraph and then wrote that on there. Very similar, but wrote it about Bitcoin news, Australia wrote it in my own way. So this just gives you guys a good idea and then you can set up shop and stuff as well. There's heaps of stuff you can do. But you guys can play around with that. Um, this just gives you a good idea of my insight on how to do this stuff and what you can do with it. Now, another way to build up the Facebook page likes is it depends how much you like annoying your friends or not. But you can invite all your friends to come and like your page. If you got, you know, some of your friends will support you and some of them won't at all. So you can invite your friends over here to support your page and stuff. Like, yeah, like your best mates and that, they'll, they'll support you hopefully and that'll get some likes rolling over. Uh, you can share your own posts of the page. Like, let's say if I started sharing Bitcoin News Australia on my, on my personal news feed, my friends might start liking it and not even know that it's my page just because it's Bitcoin News. Um, 
and then you can obviously run ads with this as well but the if we're sticking with Shopify the main things here is start building up your brand on here so start sharing things related to your niche so let's say outdoor gear so maybe you start sharing links to um like nice photos of the outdoors and just things that are going to make people want to like a page like think of if you went to the page would you like it or is it just link after link to outdoor gear with no other content because people don't just want to see like buy my product buy my product buy my product and also you want to be creating that sort of brand story on your own page so uh you know write engaging content where you're asking your followers questions and stuff like that get people commenting and that'll actually help you with the facebook algorithm as well when there's more people commenting on your page it'll show it to more people because facebook makes you want like always wants people to pay for their like pay for their exposure these days so that's just how facebook's set up but i hope that helps you guys here's another thing actually before i go you can create a group so facebook groups are really good as well and the good thing about a facebook group is like you're the moderator so you're in control of it so for instance if you build up an outdoor group uh you know outdoor gear group or whatever or the great outdoors group whatever you can only post your affiliate links in there and no one else can so if you grow that up to like a couple of hundred people or a thousand people that's a couple hundred people or a thousand people you can pump your affiliate links to or your shopify gear to but no one else can put theirs in there because you moderate the page so you can put it to um uh moderate the moderator has to has to let through all of the sorry one of my friends messaging me the moderator has to let through all of the posts or whatever and so then you can affiliate market to them no one else can so or or link to your shopify i've got affiliate marketing on my mind because i've been doing a lot of research and stuff lately but um yeah anyway i thought i would show that to you guys and then i'll keep you guys updated on like how this page goes and how i grow it and stuff like it's just a little bit of a side mission and taking advantage of a trend like I practice what I preach guys I tell you all this stuff and I go out and do it so you got to take action on these things there's no point sitting around and being like oh what if I did this or what if I did that well like normal people do that don't be average be excellent so take action um, I want to say as well go and watch these videos these videos have not got enough lo uh, views for what sort of quality I've put into them so these are free niche ideas. I posted this one today. Free niche ideas for you guys. And then this one as well, the other day as well. So I've just been, anytime I'm thinking of uh, niches and stuff, I just go live, record, and show you guys for free. And check this out. 15 likes, 0 dislikes, 12 comments. That's only posted yesterday. 9 likes, 0 dislikes, 4 comments. That's posted today. So these are full of con like good quality content. Make sure you go and watch them um, and you'll get an insight into even more product research that I do. So I'll leave this video here. Please give it a like for me. Drop a comment below if you have any questions at all about how to create a Facebook page or anything at all about Canva, whatever, I can help you out. And make sure you hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next video.